Fire! fire. <laughs> Hi guys, thanks for joining us again on another fantastic Friday. We're on Ganton Street, which is just off of Carnaby. And it's pretty exciting for everyone, not just because Laura now has a fringe. I know, it's Michelle crazy, Obama. Man inspiration amazing but more because we've had an, over a million views over now. a million viewers we, we actually haven't got over it yet and um we're coming up to 10,000 subscribers there's just so many numbers for me oh, to we're remember. gonna do a competition when we do get 10,000 subscribers not for the 10,000 subscriber but we're gonna run a competition and you can win some amazing prizes marked by Mark Jacobs I think we all love Mark Jacobs have you got it yet I must say I'm a bit gel oh. about this and neon very on trend <gasps> I'm kind of wondering is, just because I'm subscribed, does that mean I'm still in for the running for this? Oh, we could apply. We've had loads of comments, and we love the comments, good and bad. I know you prefer the good ones. Yeah, always the good ones. I thought what was interesting was the thank hashtag it's Friday video we did last week. With Sam. We talked a lot about a sort of negative comments, and then a few of you guys sort of piped up down below, which mm -hmm. I personally really enjoyed. <laughs> and um, we had people being quite reassuring, which was good, because I was down, because basically people were saying they wish I didn't survive in the snow. I don't know, there's only one person that said that. I know, I, I took it to heart, obviously. Okay. But these people, you lovely people, I had someone saying, um, saying that people who can't talk properly, so opinions are irrelevant and that they love all my videos. So at least there's one person, could have been my mum. So Noah has left a comment about Coco the dog. Oh, I love Coco the dog. Oh my God, don't you just love it? Move I over, absolutely boo. love it. And also the, um, the voiceover commentary is just, oh, we'll go into that in a minute anyway. But um, Noah wrote, what a stylish pooch. And I think we both completely agree with Noah. Clara Mills, who's a regular commenter on Fashtag, and we love you, Clara. We love that you comment on everything. Um, she's put, um, I wish I'd have known as well, because I would have gone. We could have come. It's been an amazing week of videos. Um, I really like the Grazia girls talking about Michelle Obama's fringe. I didn't know that girls could talk about fringes for so long. Wait, what's your opinion? Totally bangs, amazing. You're loving the bangs? Yeah, I just think... I mean, you've just got bangs, that I know. was a stupid question. It's really funny because I got a fringe and then Michelle got a fringe, so that was a bit weird. Yeah. She's clearly on your Twitter. <laughs> Outfit of the night from Goldie Rocks. She looked fantastic in that Aussie Clark dress. She did look so good. She was embracing the 70s, and I tell you what, it makes me want to go home and put on a pair of flares. Because she was sat here like this, this time last week in uh -huh. a jumper, and then suddenly she's out there looking like Bellatrix Lestrange. Okay, favourite video of the week. I always find it quite hard to pick, but it's easy this week. Coco the dog, hands down. I don't know if you guys agree. What's your opinions on that? I absolutely love it. It's a little bit like Come Down With Me. The show is brilliant, but because it's got exceptional commentary on, you love it even more. So basically, the voiceover for Coco the dog is basically Dave Lamb of Come Down With Me, which I tell you what, it's hilarious. that's saying something. Do you have a favourite bit? I like the bit when he goes, Leggings, jiggings, <laughs> wedges, optical point. It's so joke. Oh my God, that's my favourite bit. So. Yeah, well, it's just the best bit. <laughs> it's so good. And I'll tell you a little story about Coco because um, I once went into the office and I was like, oh my God, this dog is adorable. Um, I was wearing a white dress and I was really hugging it really mm, tight. Did it poo on you? No, it just started weighing all over me. Oh. And I had a really big yellow stain all over oh my, my dress. God. So that was my favourite video and your favourite video. Yeah. Definitely. So if people want to watch it, I think that you definitely should. Click here and have a little watch. It's this time on a Friday, the bit I kind of love and hate at the same time. It's our challenge. Are you excited? I am excited. I'm very nervous. Should we get it? Yeah. Okay, perfect. Thank okay, you. Okay, you do the reading. I'm not so good at that. Dyslexic. You are challenged to find the best celebrity lookalike you can on Carnaby Street in five minutes. Okay. Go. I'd like to say that I did cheat a little bit, but I am Northern, so what do you expect? And Joe actually works at Fashtag, but hello, Mel B. And I'm from the Cotswolds, and I didn't cheat. <laughs> and I've got Spencer from the Hills, and got this guy off the streets. Are you having a good time? I'm having a lovely time. <laughs> so, and I really believe it. You actually do look a bit like Spencer. Yeah, people have said that in the past. I'm have very, they? I'm annoyed that... Yeah, <laughs> I mean, you, you, you look like a nicer person, though. Yeah, I am, I am. Mm. Yeah, less beard. Brilliant. Well, make sure you guys comment below and let us know who you think won. And I, I would quite like to win on this one because I've, I've lost the last few and I appreciate your help, guys. My absolute all-time favourite vlogger video um, in tribute to me having my own fringe was Daily Grace cutting her fringe herself and making an absolute meal of it. She's got some stitches on her head, so she decided that um, she'd do a DIY bang. 
And um, was it worth it? Definitely should have a disclaimer saying do not try this at home. But I don't want to spoil it for anybody because it is comedy gold. So stay tuned because it's on next. Amazing. And thanks so much, guys, for watching mm -hmm. another Thank Fashtag. It's Friday. It's our third, and we're so happy for you I guys know. commenting, rating, Lucky and subscribing. Three. Yeah, don't forget to comment in the box below. And um, don't forget all those amazing prizes when we get 10,000 subscribers. So, uh, and you can't enter that competition, Lewis. See you next time.